Hi everybody, Creative Katie here. Welcome to my channel. Today is the day we are going to do a flip through of my repurposed Happy Planner. And on these pages, I have done a quote journal. And when Daisy Yellow's Index Card A Day Challenge came up, I've done it for the last three years. I was going to do it again. I chose to do it on my mini Happy Planner pages. These are the Happy Planner pages that I did some gel printing on. I gessoed some of them so and prepared them. And I used some of these backgrounds, some just gessoed ones, to do not only my quote journal, but the index card a day challenge. Now, Daisy Yellow does her challenge every year, and she gives 61 prompts throughout the month of June and July. And, you know, I didn't count how many prompts that I actually did of hers. I'm thinking maybe 2025 and stuff. And in a total pages during the Index Card Today Challenge, I think I did about 45 of them. You know, summer vacation, I've taken off a couple weeks here and there. And, you know, my goal was to create on a regular basis every day. You know, some days I didn't video um, or create an actual page. Some days I was gessoing pages or preparing stuff or building stuff that I was going to use in and on some of these pages. I love doing the Index Card a Day Challenge and I'm so thankful to Daisy Yellow for, for doing it. I think it's eight, nine years that she's been doing this and it's just tremendous. But I did, you know, take liberties, especially in not using an index card. When I started out, I also thought I might do on, do some of them on these mini coasters. I only ended up doing two or three. Two of them I've given them away, and this is one of them. This house runs on island time. Everything that is in here, or almost every page that's in here, there is a video, and you can find that in the Index Card A Day 2019 playlist or in the quote journal playlist. So, as I said, I did it on the repurposed pages from an old mini happy planner. This measures about five by seven. It's a great size for quick, easy art. So let's get going. Beach, best escape anyone can have. Now, every one of my pages, I focus on one or two techniques. So you can kind of narrow in there. And I thought I did that, especially for beginners, to give you a little bit of an idea. So I focused on using a specific supply or a technique. It features a technique. Don't look back. You're not going that way. Nothing changes if nothing changes. The sentiments that you see here, if they come from my quote journal series, they are available for purchasing. Uh, you can per email me at creativekatie at gmail.com and I will send you out a price list and, and you can go and check out the sentiment packs if, you're, if that's something that you're looking for. Love this little guy. You have to be odd to be number one. If it's important, you will find a way. If not, you will find an excuse. Let your light shine. Faith it till you make it. When something goes wrong, yell plot twist and move on. I think you need to do that when you're creating art, definitely. No one is you, that's your superpower. When life leaves you speechless, songs give you lyrics to find meaning. Love how that one turned out. You don't have to see the whole staircase, just take the first step. 
stop and smell the roses, my finger painting florals. Vintage look, balance is the key. Perseverance is not a long race, it's many short races, one after another. Believe in the possibilities. Some of these have texture paste on them, some of them have layers, some are very simple. Words matter. And I don't know if you can see under there, but I have some of my uh, sentiment collage paper pages underneath so you can see all these positive words underneath. Love how this one turned out, the, the stark contrast. In a world where you can be anything, be kind. I love doing the iCAD challenge. It, it broke through my creative <coughs> slump that I was in. It also gives me ideas. I, I bring out old supplies. I use stuff in my stash. I try different techniques or dust off some different techniques. Some of the pages that I have, I will then take some part or a whole of the idea and make canvases. So this becomes kind of a journal of possibilities for future work. Some quit due to slow progress, never realizing that slow progress is progress. Shading bringing out the background. Quality, not quantity. My circle is small. We're going to turn that a little bit here. Using collage papers, hook, line, and sinker. Such a cute page. Used a lot of magazine pictures. Coming up soon, another video showing you ideas how to get the most out of your magazines and how I use magazines in my art journaling. There's beauty in simplicity. Look where you're going, not where you've been. Don't worry if you're making waves simply by being yourself. The moon does it all the time. If you can't find the sunshine, be the sunshine. This one was using uh, my own pictures from my vacations. I had taken a picture of the starfish and I shrunk it down and, and made it bigger and used that. I know nothing with any certainty, but the sight of the stars makes me dream. In the waves of change, we find our true direction. When you change the way you look at things, the things you look at change. This was negative painting technique. If you don't like where you are, move. You are not a tree. Accept what is, let go of what was, and have faith in what will be. Using gel prints there. Don't be afraid to show your true colors. Beauty begins the moment you decide to be yourself. This was, again, one of my pictures of something I had taken in my trip to Bouchard Gardens, a flower, and I cut it and made her little dress out of it. Don't wait. Life goes faster than you think. A flower does not think of competing with the flower next to it. It just blooms. I think that one is, there's no video for it. I think I did that on a face on a Facebook Live in my Facebook group. And I'd love you to join my Facebook group. Mixed Media Creations, do a search, answer the questions, and come join the creation ship. When life gives you scraps, make a quilt. This one I got upside down. I'm not telling you it's going to be easy. I'm telling you it's going to be worth it. 
some smooshing going on there. A river cuts your rock not because of its strength, but because of its persistence. Here I colored the clear modeling paste from Crafter's Workshop. Take the scenic route. Again, one of my own pictures taken oceanfront here, just close to where I live. You can't go back and change the beginning, but you can start where you are and change the ending. There will always be someone who can't see your worth. Don't let it be you. When the world says give up, hope whispers, try one more time. Little crazy cat here. Sometimes all you can do is hang on. I think the prompt was chandelier. So I found a picture of a chandelier and went like that. Love this quote. Didn't come this far to only come this far. Why fit in when you were born to stand out? Sorry, I got a tickle in my throat. Be open to whatever comes next. If you're not a subscriber to my channel, please hit the subscribe button in the lower right hand corner. And even if you are, check, click on the bell and make sure you select the option to get notified as soon as I upload new videos. That means you'll get an email or a pop up on your laptop and you'll see the thumbnail and then you will know that I've put up a new video and then you can go and check it out if it's something that interests you or not. Take off. That was number one. That was negative painting as well. Squeeze the day. Lemons was the prompt on that one. Loved using the orange background. So much that I, when I did this orange background, I did This one, I wanted to do another one, and I'm going to do a canvas. Not my color, you know, not my color scheme, not my usual, but I love, love, loved it so much. Be yourself, because an original is worth more than a copy. I can and I will. This was collaging from a magazine, too different from a butterfly. I put the wing, I turned it into her skirt, and then I altered the magazine picture. Mirrors show us what we look like, not who we are. I was using napkin in the background and collaging magazine pictures. All great changes are preceded by chaos. What if that change you're avoiding is the one that gives you wings? If you're tired of starting over, stop giving up. Push, persist until something happens. Now I got it really dark. The secret of change is to focus all your energy not on fighting the old, but on building the new. Very simple. Little stenciling, a gel print with lots of gritty, grungy bits. Love it. Now we have just some that the other, the back side is not done. But this is my quote journal. So even though the index card a day challenge is done, I'm going to continue each month. I'm going to pick another theme. I'm going to create a sentiment pack for it with some quotes and I'm going to continue adding pages to the quote journal. And I have a whole bunch of these still gel printed instant insta backgrounds right some of these are just ready to go some i've put modeling paste on like this one's got snowflakes this one has butterflies i had leftover modeling paste and a grungy stencil so i just grabbed one of these and put it on so sometimes by the end they're pretty much done slap on a sentiment and do some finishing shading and it's pretty much done our dreams are the blueprints to our destinies. Oh, this one was a struggle. Pay 
paint is only wasted if it stays in the tube. We are so good at buying art supplies and then saving them. Use them. Honor them by using them. If you use them, you're going to enjoy the creative process because that's what it's all about. It's not wasted if you've learned something, if you've enjoyed the process. If you think you can, you can. This was using a napkin in the background and my little, my attempt to make a toucan. Stretching my limits, trying something different. What you're looking for is not out there, it's in you. Perseverance, stubbornness with a purpose. Life offers you a second chance. It's called tomorrow. Life has no remote. Get up and change it yourself. So thank you so much for joining me on my index card a day quote journal journey. I've enjoyed doing this. I am creatively sparked by this process. I have a book full of ideas that I'm going to take and translate into some canvases and bigger art and maybe try something else on an art journal page that's somewhat bigger. One of the things people often ask, so what do you do with these when they're done? Well, they're already in this happy planner. I've up, upgraded, made the, put the... I'm often asked, what do you do with these iCads, with these quote journal pages when you're done? Well, the purpose of doing them is to create every day to do something creative every day because so I've already gotten the benefit out of it but I love keeping this and flipping through this. This is a journal of ideas that I can now take and use color schemes, stencil ideas, techniques, ideas, whether it's the whole of the page like this one, I, I, I would love to do this one as a bigger canvas. I think it would be so cute in a, in a bedroom or on a fridge magnet. So I might do those things. So, you know, when I'm in a creative slump, I might grab my book and pull it down. That's one of the reasons I didn't do it on index cards because now I have it in a book. And this can just sit on my shelf. It can sit at the side of my desk. When I'm in a creative slump, I can pull it out, flip through it, maybe get an idea to spurn, give me a new plan or what to do. I might take this and turn this into several books. Because they've, they're hole punch, I can't frame them. If you just have iCads, you can frame them. You can hang them. You can put the individual ones. Even if this was just an iCad, you could put it on one of these little easels and display it. What I'm going to do with my book, I have these little wire plate trays, display ones, and I can just put my book like this and keep this on the counter. And every day I can flip and there's another inspirational quote. You can hole punch your index cards and put them on a ring so you have them all together. Past ones, I just have some right here. These were from previous years. Some I finished off and turned them into bookmarks. 
Some I put magnets on, turned them into fridge magnets if I like them. I've gifted them to people. I've even sold some of them. You know, you can hang this, display it like this, and then change them out. I've even framed them in a collage frame. So there's lots of things you can do with them. Again, not every one of these that I finished is great art. Some turned out extremely well. I'm really happy with them. But I love the quotes on all of them. And that, for me, that's, that speaks to me. So I hope that gives you an idea. Bye for now. Did you see a favorite here? Let me know which one was your favorite or favorites because we can't just have one.